Yeah, so the goal really is to make it easier for Nevadans to file those unemployment claims, make it more efficient and easy for you guys. Uh, and the Dieter, uh, the president of Dieter tells me that the modernization is in line with other states like Michigan and Oregon as they've had success with their unemployment websites. Now, Dieter director Elisa Caffaretta says this will be much easier to navigate. While it will take four years to complete, you should see some changes happening slowly within those next four years. Unemployment taxes that businesses pay will be the first module to be addressed. Caffaretta also says fraudulent claims was the biggest drive of those being processed so slowly over the past few years. So Dieter is addressing that head on. There are one and a half million people working in Nevada, but we ultimately had over two million applications for unemployment. So we got more unemployment applications than there are even people working in Nevada. So, uh, and because so much of our personal information is available on the dark web, those, those uh, fraudulent claims look very credible because they have some of our information. So we had to evaluate every single claim to see if it was a legitimate claim. And Dieter says one of the ways the modernization project will attack those fraudulent claims is to make sure to identify, uh, verify those identities, uh, especially when they are applying for those unemployment benefits in many different ways that they weren't doing before. Live here in North Las Vegas tonight, I'm Regina on Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.